Fresno City Council meetings will just not be the same. Barbara Hunt was known for not only attending, but for speaking at every council meeting. She died one week ago. Our AJ K. Akato joins us in the studio. And AJ, you heard tonight from city leaders who knew her. Steph Barber was a staple at council meetings. Her passion and love for the area, especially West Fresno, was no secret. And the people who sat opposite her at the podium say this loss leaves a big void. Barbara Hunt was a one of a kind. Oh, what? She had so much energy. Barbara Hunt will be remembered for many things. If you would like to address anything. But being silent won't be one of them. So what we need to do is we, they trying to take us into that, um, stop this thing a minute. She was uh, what I like to call the, the unofficial or the honorary eighth council person. I've never met anybody who could talk so fast and not miss a beat. I want everybody to know that the city council is a real development agency. Hunt died of cancer on July 27th at 71. For at least 40 of those years, she regularly attended all city council meetings and cared passionately about her community. She came prepared. She had an agenda. She understood the, the agenda items. She was a straight shooter. Um, she made sure that she was involved. She held folks accountable. And not just city leaders. She challenged her peers to care just as much, turning her attention from the mayor to the audience at one meeting. And I remember her getting up and talking and says, you know what, like, where were you all? I did not see you all at City Hall. You know, you need to be involved. Hunt will be remembered for giving a voice to the people in the city she loved. So Barbara was surprising. Like I said, she, sometimes you get, she, I never met anybody could talk that fast. But between the lines, sometimes you go, I'd say, no, she was right about that one. <laughs> And besides her activism, Hunt will also be remembered for her hat collection. It was lively as her dialogue with council members. In studio, AJ Cotto, KC24, Local News That Matters. AJ, thanks.